The Gale Interactive Human Anatomy Collection is a wonderful way to search for uh, human structures within your anatomy and physiology courses. So in this case, we have, if I scroll down on the landing page to the systems or the region areas, I can refine those categories by circulatory, muscular, nervous, etc. And I can also refine by categories here with the option of going to all the region categories as an option or all the system categories. If I don't see what I'm looking for there, I can see I can search all of those different systems or all the different regions uh, at the same time. It will pull in my results here to the right. Here I see I have 125 search results, which is all of the items within the system categories. If I were to select just skeletal regions, it would focus to those. If I were to then click on one of my results, uh, either by doing a search this way, browsing through it, or I can also search for activities up here in the search bar. Let's say I find something I'm interested in looking into more deeply. In this case, bones of the lower limb. This will pull up an interactive uh, viewing screen. There's text to the right, as you can see. You can change the font size, you can listen to that, and you should be able to email this uh, text out to yourself. What we have here in this viewing screen is a bit of information about bones of the lower limb. And then we have a series of slides that will walk you through the area. So in this case, we have the sacrum, the ilium, et cetera. As I get into this region a little bit more in depth, I can see that I can uh, hover over certain aspects of the bone region. I can pull them apart and look at them in more depth. So in this case, I can scroll in using the wheel on my mouse to view this in a little bit uh, more detail. I can go to the next slide. It'll put things back together for me. And I can take a look and sort of separate those and put them back. It'll highlight in green when it's back in the right area. So this is something as I go through it, you'll see the text will change sometimes to the right. And I can have lots of different information over here to the left part of the video screen talking about the different parts of the bone structures that I'm investigating. If I want to change to different activities like the knee joint or the uh, blood supply to the lower limb, these are related to the area I'm investigating. I can always switch over to those and it will load a new viewing screen and change the text that I'm reading about that area. If you have any questions about how to use this resource in greater detail, please don't hesitate to reach out to a librarian. We're always happy to help, and we hope to take care.